As a single lesbian who is childless by choice, here are some reasons why I can't rejoice. No maternity leave will I enjoy, nor paternity days to steal off my boy. As a non-smoker, I also lose out as faggers, not faggots, gather around and about. As owner-occupier of my own terrain, a day off for a house move I'm able to claim. No graduation ceremonies of goddaughters or nieces or VIP front row lead role in nativities. I've been doing the maths and the algorithm clearly states that I am owed a year off, now isn't that great? This all rings a bell, paves a path on the map of the awareness we raise of the gender pay gap. Why women should cease toil for the rest of the year, because it's all unpaid from now on, my dear. So if you have a mother, a sister, a daughter, here are some reasons why you really ought to. Come pick up your ears and feast in your lap of the harsh reality and more of the gender pay gap. Destroy it and smash it, not subtly dismantle. We take out our sledgehammers and roughly we wrangle. As did Rosa Parks on the bus seat boycott. Women's suffrage made games as Emily Davison took down the king's horse. So let's look at the details, find out why women are paid less and come up with some solutions to clear up this mess. Thank you. So in my show I then go into the...